Little play action, they got him, and it's Ben Sims right there, and he's into the end zone. Touchdown, Baylor. When you said the tight end, you had to keep an eye on number eight, and the Iowa State defense lost him. Because all the action, Iowa State is going to start flowing hard this way. we got to stop the run. And then, boom, whip that thing out, bootleg, and there's no one in sight. That, that is all set up by that wide zone run game. It's on that hit there, definitely the crown of his helmet was used, but no call. Cartavius Norman in the backfield, one-on-one -on -one there, and Xavier Hutchinson with the catch. Looking, looking, and touchdown into the hands of Jirel Brock. And it was really close. Take a look at this, initial rolling touchdown. Does he cross the plane tonight? Uh, thanks so much, Kevin, right here. Great ball game, one-on-one -on -one coverage. How Presley going up and trying to make the grab. They say yes, he comes up with it. Completes it to Presley here. And, and Miles Perks has got to find this ball. That thing hung in the air forever. You, you got to have some sense and, and some feel of where that ball is. And he was in good phase. Try to get your hand on the hip of that wide receiver and look up and find the ball. I mean, he just kind of tossed that thing up into the... First field goal attempt of the season. Hold is down and Mayers is able to push it through. Is forever immortalized here as it's named in his honor. Wide open down the middle and Blake Shapin finds Gavin Holmes. High power formation. And the bootleg there working to perfection and touchdown as Dylan Doyle catches his first offensive touchdown of the season. Iowa State saying, oh, here comes a run. We got to come and get vertical and stop it. And then just everything is going that way. Come back with one player coming back the other way, and it's a touchdown. Held by Terrell Bernard last season. Now here comes Iowa State, and here comes the pressure for Baylor, wrapping him up and bringing him down was Garmin Randolph. 176 total yards of offense. And they throw it on third and one, at least Shapin wants to, but he can't get it out in time as Gary Vaughn is there. And making his family proud as he comes from the family of Farmers. He's making his waves on the football field. Great spin move there by Brock. Deckers again. Palm in the pocket. Has the man. And yes, it's in for the score. Stanley. Dimitri Stanley with a 24 yard reception. Clock's ticking away, but he's got enough time. Doesn't have to rush anything, just scans the field and throws an absolute laser. On the inside cut to Stanley. Got to make sure you don't do that letter rip out there. On second and nine, and the catch is made, and wow. Baylor saying they have it, and what a wow. big turnover. That was a bang, bang play, and that was Devin Neal Jr with the interception. It's a little slant right here. The ball is put on the money, maybe a little bit extended, but it looks like a clean hit by Devin Lemire. So many things to uh, make a defense think about, get them spread out here. Empty set for Shapin. Shapin feels the pressure. That's Isaiah Lee giving chase. Shapin getting away, keeping his eyes downfield and finds the soft spot in the defense and the completion to Gavin Holmes for the first down. Six foot, 10 inch wingspan of Will McDonald in that play. Big number nine for Iowa State. Akin to that of Michael Jordan as the pass is oh. complete. Huddling the defender. And what a play and a move by Drake Dabney, his first reception of the game. Good for 17. Shapin hands it off. Reese, Reese who hit the hole decisively, still on his feet, and then for the score. We talk about planting that foot and going for it. That's exactly what Richard Reese did. Sideline at some point saying, young man, hit this thing downhill like we know you can. But look at the offensive line, the blocking, and in the second level, 
making guys miss. Another critical third down, this time 11 yards to go. Got to get across midfield. Deckers has some pressure from behind and he's brought down by Bryson Jackson. Jackson is a name we've called quite a bit in this second half. McDonald and Isaiah Lee, who's gotten some pressure on the interior here on third and 10. Some pressure coming, escaping Vance, but finally set, bottled up by Vance. Second of the ball game for the Cyclones. On third and three. Deckers, good decision. Found number eight, the X-Man, Xavier Hutchinson. Drive continues. They look to his side. Instead, it's intercepted. Stepping in right there is Christian Morgan with the INT. Second pick of the ball game for the Bears defensive unit. They hold on to this 10-point lead on the road in their Big 12 opener. And also, for big guys, they move. You have to with this scheme. They move lateral, and they're moving sideways, and then they're pushing on you. It makes it tough. Look at this. A little trickeration back to the quarterback. Wide open is Gavin Holmes. Touchdown, Baylor. 38 yards. Nobody was in striking distance of Gavin Holmes. Misdirection, right? We're going this way. We get you going that way. And you'll see it just kind of starts off a little zone run to the right and come back, flip it to the quarterback. And there was only a question of is he going to catch it, right? Because <laughs> he was. <laughs> Yeah, and that's part of it. It is a first time starter. It's all about experience, but you can see the difference in the, between the two halves. Uh. Everybody just wrapping them up and then some extracurricular after the play. And make it hard on a young quarterback. The master of a wizard when he was at LSU doing that, but then coming right back. And nice response from the sophomore quarterback finding Dimitri Stanley, who has been his uh, second favorite guy to go to today. Need to convert here. They ask Brock to pick up one. He says, I'm going to get more along the left side. One man to beat, and he's just the tackler in for the score. But did he hold on to the football is the question. Therefore, it's a touchback. First down, Baylor. And that was Miranda Johnson who poked it out at the last minute right wow. before he crosses the goal Look line. Look at this. Woo, what a play. What an exceptional job by Johnson just using that right hand and bringing it a little uppercut, popping the ball out. And Jarrell Brock thinks he has a touchdown. He says, hey, we're back in this game. I mean, and this is the kind of thing, I guarantee you, Dave Aranda is going to replay this play about 47 times tomorrow. <laughs> One thing is for sure, they're going to give some sort of unique look that Deckers is going to have to figure out. Deckers, tough throw, even better catch made by Jalen Noel. Noel has one man to beat along the sideline. Oh, he just steps out of bounds. Catch in a critical moment of the game. They do bring a blitz. It's picked up by the... And what an amazing catch. We've talked about the contested catches. Get Jalen Noel in the, in the slot right there. He's looking his way the entire time. Spin move avoids the tackler and down to the one yard line. And it goes through. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus.